Hello everybody and welcome to Real and Virtual Outdoors. On today's episode, we're going to be at the Ebro uh, River in Spain, playing on the catch, carp, and course with a PlayStation 4. Going to be river fishing today for catfish. I'm going to pull up here to this little point, uh, get some lines set out. Um, tell you what kind of bait we're going to be using. I usually fish from the bank, but today we're going to try it from a small boat. We'll be in about 35 feet of water here. I want to pitch these lines out and uh, see if we can get some fish going. We're fishing some dead bait, uh, mackerel, some uh, uh, cut bait type things. We'll talk about that a little more as we go along in the video. I got three lines out. Uh, Looks like we got to <clears throat> do a little baiting out here. This thing that I'm casting out here, it's a bait rod basket. It holds a feed. You pitch it out, it disperses in the water. Something they use over in England works well. Uh, so we got a fish on here, I believe. <clears throat> yep. The fish basket, as I speak it of, does wonders. It disperses the food out, draws the fish in. It's the same concept they use in England, where well, they use pack bait. We have 40 pound braid line, 12 foot rods, long casting rods. These rods and line I bought uh, from tackle money earned from catching fish in this game. This looks like to be just an average side size catfish, nothing spectacular. And he's ready to come on in the net now. Channel cat, he called it a smelt head, just a common. I can hear that uh, bait alarm going off again. We have another fish on. We'll start in on this one now. I really enjoy playing this uh, catch carp, of course. Uh, I like to catfish in it. Uh, I enjoy catching the carp as well. But uh, there's some lure fishing in there for salmon and stuff. I enjoy that. But really, my main focus is on when I play this is to come to this river and catfish. Uh, I always looking to catch a, a whale's catfish. Uh, don't always get one, but they're fun to get. A little different color catfish here. About the same size, another channel. That was caught on a whole mackerel. Just a common. Get my lines casted back out here and try to get ready for the next fish. Uh, talk about the whales, catfish. I, I always love to catch those on, in in the game here. 
they're big and they put up a nice fight. Uh, they're located uh, throughout the world. Uh, they're big over in Europe. Uh, we don't have any of those here in the, in the United States. Looks like the smelt head rod's got another fish. Not hear that uh, thumping noise in the background. That's going to be uh, a heartbeat. That's going to be, uh, I didn't get a good hook set on that fish. I'm going to have to play this one out a little bit better. This spot that we're fishing today, if you'll look up on the top of the screen, you'll see uh, uh, a fish finder with fish going from uh, right to left. And you'll see uh, to the right of that a picture of the map about where I'm at. It's kind of a bend here. It's a point. It's a deep point right here. And you take notice of the gray. Uh, building in front of us. This is a good spot. I've caught quite a few fish here. Uh, you can adjust your tension on your drag uh, by pushing the uh, pad button up or down and your reel speed by using the left and right number two mouse pads on the PlayStation remote, or not mouse pads, but button pads on the back of the PlayStation. I believe this is gonna be a little bit bigger fish. Yeah, he's a little bigger. He's another one of those black town cats. Quite a bit bigger, 35. That's also on the smelt head. And he's a rare, so we got a rare on that. Uh, different classifications for fish. Uh, in the game here. I think we've got another one on the whole mackerel. For those of you that might be wondering, this is a, a dovetail uh, fishing game. Uh, dovetail recently come out with Bassmasters 2022. Gonna have some videos dropping on that really soon now. Uh, we're gonna be doing some lives possibly on that. I don't believe this is a catfish. I think it's going to be a different type of fish. Can't quite tell what he is yet. That's an eel. <laughs> I haven't caught one of them in a while. Just a common eel. Strange looking creature. Yeah, the bait alarm is going off again, I think. Yep, number three's got a fish on it. Sort of fast paced. Kind of fun. I have had them on all three rods at the same time. That could be a little bit of a mess. This one's put it a little. 
not coming in quite as easy. He may be a little bigger. I really like these 12 foot rods uh, that I bought out of Tackle Buddy. They, they give you a little bit more leverage uh, on these bigger fish. Well, these bigger fish fight hard. That's an 18 pound common channel cat. That's on a whole roach. All about the same size. Little time passed there in between bites, and uh, we got a hit here on uh, number two rod. Well, uh, I get this one in for you. Uh, you know, if I'm wanting just a relaxing uh, time, just to sit back and kind of play a game and not be too intense. Uh, this this type of uh, fishing is kind of fun for me. Uh, fishing planting also is another one that uh, is fun. Just sit back, throw some lines out, wait on a catfish. Uh, but I've enjoyed this the catch. Uh, I, I enjoy the carp fishing and the cat fishing. I was a big fan of uh, uh, Euro fishing when it come out. I still play it. I have a video of uh, me playing that particular game. Uh, I believe it's titled Carp in the Dark. You might want to check that out. It's, Pretty good action in that video. I believe it's going to be a whales here. I believe I've got a whales here. Oh, yeah. That's, that's going to be the one there we wait on. I hadn't caught one of these in about a week. Jerry like to play this a little bit every day. And, uh, if I can get around to it. Sometimes I'm on the, the Hunter Call of the Wild or uh, Fish and Sim World, but I'd like to play this as much as I can to try to get a shot to get one of these. I, I think they're a neat looking fish. He's ready to come on in the net. And boy, that is a beautiful green spotted one. That is a good looking dude. 56 pounds. Wow. On the smelt head. That's going to be about the end of this video. I hope you will subscribe to Real and Virtual Outdoors. Give me a thumbs up, hit that notification bell so you know I drop a video, you know I've got one released. I thank you for being part of the real and virtual outdoors family. Have a nice day.